Hey everybody, uh, welcome. I am Big Tex here, and today I'm going to walk you through uh, why you should download Truckee. Uh, Truckee has several good alternatives uh, when it comes to ATS and trucking in general. Well, one good reason is uh, I have here Coast to Coast. Everyone's always asking, how do I get Coast to Coast? Which considers everything uh, east of Texas. Louisiana, Arkansas, Missouri, uh, Iowa, Dakotas, and Nebraska, and beyond. Now, Coast to Coast is a mod, but like I said, you have to, in order to uh, have Coast to Coast functioning properly, you got to have all the DLCs that every that uh, American Truck Similar has put out. You have all those, you are golden. And of course, whenever you do get AT, get a uh, coast to coast, make sure it's an updated version. Uh, this is what it looks like uh, when it's all said and done. But you're like, how do I download Truckee? Where do I find this? And what features does it have? So we're gonna cover some of those features. Like uh, what you would do is uh, type in on Google uh, Truckee, and you can download and install it for Windows. Uh, of course, I do have it already downloaded. But you can choose to allow the updates or not. That's totally up to you. Even though I do have it downloaded, I'm going to show you the steps on uh, making sure that you download it correctly. So you can go and actually uh, use Truckee for your future uh, mods that you may be interested in. Maybe you saw someone that has a cool mod and you're like, I like Truckee because it keeps track of all your records and keeps the mods updated. It has states like coast to coast, Canada, or just a few of the states. So you click to download Truckee. All right, so it downloaded. Next, you will just go and it will ask you if you want the overlay, Truckee for overlay, and this is what it'll say. You say yes or no uh, to make changes to your device. I always say yes. And uh, it's gonna download and ask a series of questions. Uh, you can see this is a Truckee. Uh, I usually tend to silence the overlay. That's my personal preference. But when you do have Truckee downloaded and you're like, okay, I have Truckee. Now what? So what you're going to do next is, and on this uh, map you see, or on this app, this is what it looks like whenever you are having Truckee. Right now I'm level 19. I've logged a lot of mileage. It's got my members here, everyone who's taking place. It's got uh, just about everything you would need. It's got my dashboard to where it keeps track of all my mileage, uh, racing, and otherwise real stats. Who's dri driven? Why didn't keep track of my recent large suits? I have no idea. None of us got credit for that, apparently. But uh, it's got the. What you want to do is first, you want to go and make sure your status is set to American Truck or Euro Truck Simulator. And it gives you a game summary, your settings, uh, which uh, gives you more detailed information uh, from how you want it to be captured, integration, customization for each one. Uh, that's why whenever you see the orange bars, that's the primary color I have showing up. You got other settings here. I mean, uh, it is, you can customize whatever you want uh, for the in-game app itself. So I make it feel like you are a part of a truck and con, well, not convoy necessarily, but uh, they have a mod manager here. And so uh, they have mods for ETS, mods for ATS. I typically go with the ATS because that's what I run most of the time. If you don't see the mod that you are looking for, here's what you see. You can see on the right side, all these I have installed already, and it downloads it for you. So you don't have to do nothing. You don't have to worry about third parties installation. You just have to basically uh, enjoy the uh, fact that, hey, it's already in there. The work is already done for me. And so throughout this process, uh, you can find a map that is not installed. Like this one's a fairy patch. Click download on the right side. You see the download queue, it is downloading it. And again, it goes directly into the game itself. The most simplest way of doing it. And as I mentioned, I 
say you're looking for a coast to coast, which is one of the more popular ones. Now, coast to coast is a mod, just like anything else. So here's a coast to coast I have. And look how many people who have downloaded it. 60,000 people have downloaded coast to coast and are using it in their game right now. It is one of the more updated games that I've ever played. Or even though it's a, they've done a lot better than just flat lands. I mean, the realism is unreal when I say so myself. And so whenever you are uh, downloading that, like I said, let it download. And then the final result will look like this. You get to travel all over the place from Florida uh, to uh, Baltimore, New York. I mean, it's endless. It goes all the way up to Labrador City, which is a part of the U.S. too. Oh, no, that's... Wait, is that Canada? Oh, that's Canada. I'm sorry. So it goes all the way up to Maine, which is where we went last time. So up to Maine. And I got Canada in here too. Grand Rapids, Chicago. Places are just endless. Lots of miles of travel throughout. Now, whenever final thought here is whenever you do decide you want to download this after you have all the states, I repeat, you must have all states. You want here is where you put it on the mod order. Now I have a lot of mods here, probably about 50 or so. Where you put coast to coast is directly right at the very bottom here. See, the order I'm running is is always maps. Above maps is cargo, and need cargo installation. Above that is trucks. And they keep going back. You got these mega, the Sissel Mega Packs. Keep going up after that. You got paint schemes and some miscellaneous stuff. Most of these are paint schemes at the top. And I have designed, done some more, which I'm going to tell you more about that on another stream. But this is where you put coast to coast all the way at the very bottom, no matter what maps at the bottom. Can't, if you decide to get Canada, it goes right above that. If you want to go up to Canada and another time I'll teach you how to do, uh, go to Mexico. But right now this is what, uh, I've been working on. We've been doing a convoy through this and maybe I'll catch you on the next convoy. We're always looking for more people to join us. The more the merrier. Come out, have some fun, and uh, join us on this coast to coast convoy. Like I said, having all the mod, you must have all the DLC mods. That includes California. Actually, let me go back to it. That includes, to finish up our time here, So please download the Truckee app. It is a mo it will be your best friend, not your enemy. It does not take a lot. You see that orange bar above? That's uh, the Truckee app keeping track, giving you the time frame, what it is in real time. And so again, if you want to go go coast to coast, you got to have the normal, all the map, all the regular maps uh, in order to ride coast to coast from California. Arizona, Colorado, Nevada, Washington, Oregon, Montana, Idaho, Wyoming, Oklahoma, Kansas, Texas, and New Mexico. So you got to have all those maps right there. And if you do that, the possibilities will be endless. You could go, I mean, who knows how far you can go. But I want to thank you all for uh, tuning in. And uh, hopefully you go down and download that Truckee app yourself. You will not be disappointed. And I want to thank you for uh, being a part of this. Like I said, download and install that Truckee app. And I'll catch you on the next one. This is Big Tech Center. Over now.